This week at the Manic Cement Works here in Ballycon County Cavan, we have welcomed 6 senior researchers from the Technical University of Denmark uh, to carry out some tests and analysis on the equipment here. The project we're working on is called Process Technology for Sustainable Building Materials. The project started in 2018 and, and runs for, for five years. It's a collaboration project co-funded by Innovation Fund Denmark and the three parties working on it are the Technical University of Denmark, Efro Smith and Rockwell. Manuk got involved in the project a number of years ago when FLS and Mr. Jensen made contact with us to see would we participate in this new project. Um, it evolved from there, they presented their uh, research to us. We then proceeded on to a uh, desktop and carried out some tests on the plant and ultimately we have ended up putting in the test equipment and uh, the research has been continuing on for the last two years. The researchers we have here this week are at several levels. We have um, senior researchers, we have postdoc students and we have um, PhD students all doing research in different fields. We have three main different fields which we're working in, working on. So the, the one is on gas analysis and emissions, particularly NOx emissions. And then we have other researchers who are working on build-ups and deposit formation on how to control that. And then the last level we have is those who are looking at alternative fuel combustion and how to model the combustion of alternative fuels in the process. The students get different benefits, but, but I think a, a very important part is that they get the industrial experience. There's a big difference between the lab and the ideal worlds where you have an extremely complex process with so many aspects, so they get an understanding of how complex the world is. It's not about solving one problem at a time, but linking everything together. We have to reduce our fossil fuels uh, dependency and our emissions ultimately are coming down all the time and we hope to achieve further reductions. The ultimate goal is to produce sustainable building materials and to make the global cement industry more energy efficient, to reduce CO2 emissions and to better control the process emissions. Back in 2014 the plant introduced uh, SRF it's a no charge of fuel. Um, by doing so, we have re replaced some of the fossil fuels. And by this new project being put in place, we would hope to reduce it further. And ultimately, we want to get completely away from fossil fuels and use alternative fuels. But it will also make Manok more sustainable as a cement producer. <laughs>